Um, today I'll be showing you a short tutorial, more like a tip trick uh, when you're using sample loops. So right now I just have a quick like complex short loop going on. You can hear the bass. Uh, oops. Say, for example, I find a nice uh, a loop, a vengeance, or whatever you guys use, and and say you just want just one part of it. You don't want the whole thing. You just want, say, like a tom or a clap. I'll show you guys a quick trick. Um, so this is the loop I just selected, <clears throat> and everything is cool except I just want this part right here which is kind of like the it's kind of like a tom just this I don't want the hi-hats and so uh, to do that what you want to do um, so just click on here click on the loop double click on it and you should get a a window like this if not just click envelope and you should get your envelopes here and you want to do is click on the volume modulation. So I just want this little tom right here. What I do, I'll place a marker on it and then turn this one all the way down. And just for the other ones, same thing. Yep, just for this one as well. And the last one, which is right here. I'm just doing this real quick, but you do have to like kind of fine tune everything. So yeah, that's basically it. Um, you can just duplicate it to keep going. Yeah, so all you have to do is just control the volume. Um, that's what I usually do. So it's just a quick, quick way that I found out. Um, let's see what else? Yeah. So just whatever loop you find, and say you want to clap from it. All you have to do is just find a clap and turn down the volume for the other stuff that you don't want. And for this example, I just wanted the tom part. So I put I left the volume at 100% and I just turned down for everything else, which in this loop is um, hi-hats. And to get there, all you have to do is just click envelope if it's not already on. And click uh, clip and volume and control it that way. So yeah, that's about it. Um, make sure to subscribe, um, like us on Facebook, check out our website, and stay tuned for more tutorials.